YouTube, I'm, yo, what's good, YouTube? I'm back with another video. I don't know if it started. I have to say, yo, what's good, YouTube, two times. But look, say video. There's three things I wish I would have learned before before leaving high school, bro. Look, and I, I learned them. So everything I'm finna say in the video, bro, I need y'all to listen closely. I need y'all to learn. I need y'all to take notes, bro. Because this is stuff that people wouldn't told me going into my high school, going into a freshman, bro. But I ain't listen until I got out of high school and everything, you know. Number one, if you're an incoming freshman, bro, listen. Social media is at its peak. If you're an incoming freshman, any really any grade, bro, right now. If you're a freshman, sophomore, junior, or senior, and you want to start your YouTube journey, take advantage of it, bro. If you got any friends that's girls at the school, you got any homeboys that you cool with that, that's going to record your videos, take advantage of it, bro. Because, look, I, I, I never knew this until my senior year. I blew up my senior year. If you don't know me, Search me up, 3.k underscore Javier on TikTok. I got 920,000 followers. I blew up. I got like 100k. I went to 100k to 700k in one year. On Instagram, I'm at 102k followers. Active, real followers. No no bot followers, none of that. YouTube, I got four YouTube channels. But like this thing, I'm going to tell y'all, bro. If y'all Either grave, if y'all want to start y'all little YouTube journey, anything, social media, clothing journey, bro, use it to your advantage. You in school. People going to support you, bro. Listen. Okay, if you starting off, you don't got that much friends. Okay, you probably won't have that much people support you just because this is how high school is. I ain't, I ain't finna sugarcoat shit with y'all. Like I tell y'all every other video, if you want a sugarcoat nigga, go to another person's YouTube channel. I'm gonna tell y'all straight up. Listen, if you starting something, I'm gonna keep it straight up. Listen, one more thing, hold on. Before I get into this, I gotta let y'all know this because it's facts. My freshman and sophomore year, I used to walk around school, bro. I wasn't the type of people people would come up to and talk to. Like, I was cool with everybody, but it's like, I would have to walk up to to a person for them to talk to me. As soon as I started in clout, everything people start coming up to me. Yo, what's good? Three K. Yo, let me be in a video. This that's how it's gonna be. So if you starting to on your journey right now, you probably won't have people talking to you like that. Don't take it offensive. As soon as you get your your bro, you the people who's with you right now at the beginning of your journey, you gotta stay with them. Listen, because. You don't see the difference. Okay, another thing. If you're a junior, if you're a junior or a senior, you need to listen to this. Not everybody your friend. Not everybody your friend, bro. Listen. And growing up, going to my freshman year and sophomore year, I used to always see quotes on Instagram. People tell me on Instagram. People tell me in person. People tell me at who graduated high school. Hey, bro, watch who you hang around with. Even my teachers, I never understood what my teacher meant when they always told me, watch who you hang around with. That's not the right friend group. I could tell. They used to always tell me that, but I used to always think ahead of myself and be like, man, she don't know what she's talking about. Listen, everybody not your friend, bro. Okay, your freshman and sophomore year is cool because your first two years of school, bro, you probably think people your friend. You probably don't have a couple friends. As soon as you get to listen, and it's true. Freshman year, your group won't be like 30 plus people of friends. All your friends from middle school, new coming friends. Sophomore year is going to lower down to your senior year. You probably going to have five through ten friends, bro. Five real friends. Okay? Listen. Everybody not your friend, bro. Another thing, like I said, if you going back to YouTube thing, if you trying to start YouTube or social media, something, TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, and you got friends that's girls, Ask them to be in your video. Stop ask, stop being scared. Like, tell them, ask them to be in your video. Like, try to get them in your video. Because, look, people love to watch boys and girls in one video. They like to watch that shit. Get that in your video. Another thing, bro. Be confident, bro. Listen. Listen, listen, listen. I'm going to tell you this from based off experience. The baddest girl, the girl that you think that's all that, she's not really all that, bro. Don't be scared to go up to her. Nine times out of ten, you go up to her and start talking to her, she's going to talk back. Bro, listen, the baddest girl you think that's the baddest girl that nobody could pull, you just got to have confidence, bro. I done seen the 10 out of 10s date 2 out of 10s, bro. I done seen 10 out of 10 girls date dudes that, that look like dragons, bro, just because they're confident, bro. Don't be scared of that. And I got to get back on this thing, though, because I really want y'all to know this thing, bro. Not everybody's your friend, bro. You get into that senior sophomore year, not everybody your friend. Don't don't tell people your business. Don't do all that, bro. To me, I I've been real to every single motherfucker I've been around, bro. I've been so real to everybody I've been around. 
you can't name one nigga that tell you 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 bro listen nobody who watching the video could go to my instagram nobody bro nobody could come out on social media and say yeah javert a fake motherfucker he never told me this he never kept it real with me every single one of my i done lost homeboy because i kept it real with him like it's thing like that like bro like you gonna lose friends bro especially you a real motherfucker like me i'm gonna tell my home like i tell y'all my homeboy doing something down bad. I'm going to tell him straight up. Like, nigga, you down bad. Stop doing it. Instead of a motherfucker telling him, you good, bro. You keep doing that. No. So, yeah, keep it real. You don't see who your real friends, bro. Stack up. Another thing. Stack up. Save your money in high school. This is the thing I never knew in high school. You see all these people. You think all these people buying their cars. Listen, bro. When I was a sophomore, I had a car, but I couldn't drive this shit to school because the principal... If you look at my TikTok, I got a spell from that school. You will see all. You will see the reason I couldn't do none of that shit. But boom, listen. Most of these people that's coming to pulling up to school with these super clean, nice cars, you think you got a, bro? They putting down payments on that shit, bro. Go to save about two, three thousand dollars. Go to the shop. Go to a car lot, and have someone sign off. Put a two thousand dollar down payment. You get a clean ass charger, a clean ass Benz, anything, bro. BMW, something like that. Just pay 500 a month off on that shit. Another thing, bro. One more thing, bro. Graduate. Listen, bro. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. I'm not finna. I'm not finna tell you. Graduate, bro. My freshman sophomore year, I was bad as hell, bro. Listen, bro. The beginning of my senior year, y'all probably think I'm capping. I put this on everything I love. Go on my Instagram post at three dot k underscore j a v. I literally, when I graduated, I wrote a paragraph for the people that doubted me. How bad? Listen. I wasn't no dumb motherfucker. I was just bad. I didn't give a fuck about school or class. I wasn't going to class or none of that. I had three credits. You think I'm capping? I had three credits my senior year. You supposed to have 24. I was bad. I didn't give a fuck. I was blown up on TikTok. I was like, man, I'm, I'm viral. I don't got to go to class. Boom. I got spilled. The greatest thing that happened to me. I got spilled. My, my assistant principal, she really fucked with me. She sent me to another uh school where I gained all my credits. I graduated early, bro. And I graduated on time. So, graduate. I want to tell y'all that. It's not cool to be bad, bro. At the end of the day, I promise you not. I promise you, listen. 10 out of 10 of the people that was bad, they knew it was cool to get in trouble at school. When I was a freshman through sophomore to junior, they all bombs right now. No cap. They all is bombs. Promise you so graduate. That's the last name, bro. But yeah, if y'all new channel, make sure y'all like, come subscribe, turn on post notification, man. We out.